Hi! In this video, you will learn how to create this beautiful yet simple animated SWOT analysis diagram. Can you see on a click, we have the cursor coming in and clicking on the abbreviation and providing the explanation. The best part about this animation is even a beginner can do it and it looks quite impressive. Let me show you how it is done from scratch. Before that, I am Ram Gopal from presentationprocess.com. We help professionals like you create engaging presentations. First, I'll show you how I got this effect of something clicking and you can see that the click is shown by the depression of the button. I'll show you how it is done. Let us go to a new slide. First, let us use the rounded rectangle to create a button of this sort. And to give it the kind of shiny effect, all you need to do is to first choose your color and then go to shape effects, go to preset and use one of these options. I chose this one called as preset 5. And then I clicked on the shape and wrote S, which represents strength. So I chose to have a much thicker font and increase the size substantially. You can choose any font that you like. Now we have the raised version of the button. Now let me press Ctrl D to create a duplicate. And this time I'm going to change the look and feel of this. Let us not have any of the sheen and everything. So let us go to no presets. Then we are going to change the shadow effect from the outer shadow to inner shadow. Let us go to shape effects, go to shadow and let me go to shadow options before I select the preset. Let us choose the preset and the one I am choosing is this inner one called as inside top left. And you can see that immediately we have this depression shown. You can always increase the effect by increasing the distance and you can see it is even more pronounced here. Now the next step is to bring in a cursor. So let us go to insert. Then go to icons and choose a cursor and hit enter. You can choose any of these. Let us choose this one and say insert. And let us place this somewhere over here. So these are the three elements. Now let me show you the animation part. It is extremely simple. Watch it carefully. The first thing we are going to do is to have this float in. So select the cursor and have this float in. Or if you want it a little more excitement, then go to more entrance effects and choose this one called as rise up and say OK. Now watch this. When I go to slideshow, it comes and then it gives that impression that it is clicking on something. So that is the first event. Let us go to animation pane and you can see what we've got here. Right as that happens, you will have this one disappearing. So you go to animations and say disappear, which is the exit animation. So this comes in and this disappears. And at the same time, I want to add some sound so it looks even more dramatic. Let me go here to the animation event, double click it. So that brings up the effect options and choose the option called as click and say OK. So that is the effect we are going for. And this will happen after previous. So that is after this comes in, this will disappear. And let us place this right above. So I'm going to right click bring to front and place this right on top of the other one and bring this and this again needs to be brought to the front and placed right on top of this. Now watch this. On a click we have that happening. So it gives the impression that this button is being pressed. Now all you need to do is to make multiple copies of this and place them one next to the other, change the text and then add the relevant explanation and if you do that you will have this option which looks quite impressive. The SWOT analysis is a commonly used slide in a business presentation and there are many ways you can represent the idea. For example, you can keep it extremely simple like this and then can have each of the letters explained like this. It's a very basic animation. If you want it slightly more complex, you can have something like this where we have the explanation for S and then we draw the viewer's attention to the next one, to the next one, and to the next one. And a variation of a two by two matrix is a format model. By the way, all these that I'm showing you are from comprehensive all-in-one bundle where we have a separate collection of more than 425 models of different types from different industries. So you have pretty much every popular model covered. For example, this format model looks like this. Can you see on a click, we have a hand that brings in each of these quarters. Then. If you want to have something in Six Sigma, we can do something like this. On a click, we have the attention brought to the next one, to the next one, to the next one, 
and to the next one. And if you are looking for something very simple, like a product lifecycle diagram, we have that available as well. So any kind of models or frameworks that you want represented, we already have done all the hard work. You just need to pick the slide and stick it in your presentation and your presentation will be ready in no time. For those of you who don't know what comprehensive all-in-one bundle is, it is 4,500 plus animated PowerPoint templates collection that make your presentations beautiful and engaging in a matter of minutes. The link is in the description box below the video. You can visit this page and know more details about it. By the way, in our presentation process YouTube channel, you already have this tutorial called Create Better Slides for SWOT Analysis. It'll be quite an interesting video for you to watch right after this video. I will leave a link to that right here on your screen. You can click on the link and watch that video next. And if you want to sign up for our 25 creative PowerPoint ideas, five day free email mini course, you can click on the link here and join the course. You will get 25 useful PowerPoint ideas you can implement in your next presentation. So click on the link, join the free course and I will see you inside.